Let's check out these options. Eh, that's a little dude. Uh, uh, what? No, cancel. Really, dude? No was? Mmm, I don't know about that. Monster Sanctuary is a land far from any other human civilization. While wall monsters are dangerous to humans, monsters raised by them grow loyal to their owners. There's 150 monsters around the world, and we're gonna catch them all. Ugh. Green slime, brown bird, keeper strong. <laughs> Just it's like in the Pokemon wrap. Uh, I won't skip it. I'll see the whole cinematic. Uh, I'm taking this beginning music though. He calls those monster keepers. Ode wa monster keeper does. Ooh. My blood ride! Spectral wolf, spectral eagle, spectral toad, or spectral lion. Fire, earth, fire, water. I like this water wolf. You and the other Pokemon masters! <laughs> Monster keepers. Four prominent old bloodlines. Hated by a spectral familiar. Those familiars are ageless protectors of their family, passed on from one keeper to the next. Oh! That's me. I'm gonna cover my face because of COVID. <laughs> Name your familiar. Uh Hmm Initiate a fight by contact. We'll see if we live up to your ancestors. So, uh, I don't like this at all. So, options input spaces jump and confirm. Sure, up W. Left. Uh, down. Right. Oh, sorry. F, M. Text input. Why would I want text input? Tab. Oops. Half the cap slack? No. Yeah, sure.
right, let's see here. Claws cost 50. Ice House 45, 50. Okay, it's energy. Q and E is switch my monsters, so it's just him. Let's just claw the blob. Oh, sick. I say all the blob. Oh. Need a blah bag. Now you need a hatchet. Open the inventory menu and try to hatch it. Inventory. Blob. Bob the blob. Oh, you can put equipment on your dudes. Uh, what is inventory anyway? Consumables. Combat consumables. Crafting materials. This is your first monster you hatched by yourself. Right now it's weak, so you need to train it. More in order to learn too. Uh, you and that blob are quite alike. Let's continue on a keeper's trail. Let's say, old Baran, an old friend of mine. He is a patient teacher to all your young keepers who seek guidance. I advise you to listen to very carefully. You have to beat the ten Pokemon Masters. Let's fight these blobs, I guess. I'm not sure if I like, um, that it tells you how much damage it's gonna do. Okay, so the, he's trying against the uh, he's trying against bubble burst. So he's trying against water. I'm not sure what the resource system is here. I think I guess they go up. Ah, uh, these sound effects. I may have to turn these down as well. Uh, options, audio. Okay. Oh, that jump height. Whoa! All right. Whoa. And keep it as a keeper's trail beginning for all the man beasts sanctuary at the beginning. What? Oh, what's this thing? Oh shit, that did more damage.
I wonder if attack is the only option you get. Um, let's try Ice Hail. Nice, got a crit. Okay. Mm oh, skill points. The masters gain experience to increase in level. This allows them to gain new skills. You should take a look at this skill tree menu. Skills. Level up his ice. His claws. Where he can gain spectral flame. Or his wind. Air cycle four times fifty five percent. 220% physical damage. Mana symbiosis. Recover 5 mana when healed. Triggers on any healing effect. Improve attack rating by 1. Increase attack by 6. For magic rating 1. Oh, it's a pretty significant increase to Ice Hail. Every hit is temperature intense applied chill. Healed by 15% of the damage dealt to enemies is pretty good. Oh, you can combine this with this. Pretty good. Heidi, glory. Or big buff to 6% damage buff to claws, eh? Hmm. Tell you what, I'll get this. And then the next time I level up, I'll get that. And then I'll start upgrading skills. What about this guy? Acid rain. Applies armor break, that seems pretty good. And he gets slime shot poison. Hmm. Maybe I'll get acid rain when he levels up. Every attack triggers an additional hit equal to 30% of magic value. What? Seems to be a lot of cool skill trees here. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna fill out those maps. Ooh, a treasure chest. Uh, inventory. Equipment. Yeah, put that on you. Hey friend, you're starting a monster cube, right? Did you find some equipment for your monsters already? You can make your monsters trying to be equipping them. Yeah. I know this. Kunai. Uh, equipment for Bob. Put this kunai on him. Wait, wait, wait. Do they have accessories? No. Hey fellow keeper, do you know that every single one of your monsters possesses a special ability? Some can be used to get rid of certain obstacles. Also, you might encounter some destructible walls, like the one behind me. Monster abilities. F the monster ability. What? Okay. Uh, there doesn't seem to be a way up there. So we get this bird! So I should have leveled up Aerosicle. There's a ton of damage. I like when you kill them, they drop eggs. Damn it! 
Okay. So he leveled up. Mm, I may get that Acid Rain, but also focusing on combo heal. And healing action triggers an additional heal on monsters to lowest health equal to 30% magic value. Interesting. Yeah, let's get Acid Rain in there. Acid Rain level 2 increases mana regen to the whole party by 10%. That seems pretty good. Improves health rating. 5 bolts, 6 bolts, 8 bolts. Wow. I wonder if it's best to like grind or something. Man, prospers, blah blah blah. What? Are you telling me? There's no way to grind there. Yeah, I made that jump. Bracelet. Equipment. Bracelet. Defense plus 10, mana regen plus 12. Okay, cool. Something else up there. Oh, it's another Digimon. <laughs> I mean, Monster Mon. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, no. Gauntlet. Ah, oh, I keep pushing I for inventory. Maybe I should change that. Equipment, gauntlet, defense plus 12, crit chance plus 5. Yeah, I'll put that on him. Feed, consumable status. Oh, okay, interesting. Playing this on mouse and keyboard, by the way. So I saw this, uh, the reason why I'm playing this game is because I saw this on Reddit, and I was like, wow, Metroidvania plus Pokemon? I'm all about that. Let's try Acid Rain out. And then we'll combine that with claws. Blah, blah. Oh. Beating. Acid rain, bitches. Let's try ice hail. Meet the grass, it says. Oh, okay. You don't always have to do a move. Oh, I got it. We got the bird egg. Inventory. Vero egg. Hatch the Vero egg. Yes. Bam. No wonder there's so many monsters. <laughs> well, we're not going to call you Vero. We're going to call you... Um... Hey, Bird Arrow is a skill point. Level up beating. Or I can get mana plus or health plus. Might. Power. Applies might buff the whole party. Applies sorcery buff to a random monster. Uh, I like a buffer. A good buffer would be nice. I don't know what that does. T buffing. Uh, each attack triggers an additional 40% damage hit. Yeah, sure. Nice. Alright. I'm going to try that out. Go back there and see if I can get the uh, 
the item, maybe go higher than... No, there's no way I can get up there. I see you up there, though. Let's see if I can go back and get this item, though. Ah, almost. There we go. Uh, inventory. What do these walnuts do? Ah, oh, food. Oh, it's equipment. All right. This is really neat. I see you up there. <laughs> right, keep your stronghold. Left, keep your trail. What about down? Damn it. Nope, not gonna happen. The way he's got this jump designed, you're not gonna do it. Uh, I should probably play this with a controller at some point. Blah, blah. This is Path Keeper Stronghold. We should continue on the Keeper's Trail first, you fucker. Alright. Stick to the path. <laughs> Stick to the predetermined path that I have set out for you. I wonder if I can do, um... I have to interact. Manu, blah blah blah. Alright. Let's see if this bird will get me up here. Nope. Okay, what if I jumped up here? And I did a long jump over here. Yeah! Looks like he can carry me some distance. What does this do? Mana plus 10. His mana is pretty low, so. His mana is 54, 31. Defense plus 10. Ah! Oh. Defense is low, mana is high. 119 mana, wow. His mana's low. Alright. The bird seems to be the most useful one so far for in terms of movement and stuff. Supply to the whole party? Oh, wow. Oh, it overwrites the buff? Oh, no, no, we still have it. Arcane Bolt! Do it, Bob! Yeah. Damn. Three. Skills. Alright, Hydrosis. What am I getting here?
Let's try this out, and then I'll start, you know, figuring stuff out here. Cooling. Every hit is a 10% chance to apply chill. Uh, I'll just go a little tiny bit further, but I have to stop because I have to get it ready to go to work. <laughs> Orb. Morning Star. Okay. Uh, uh, significant defense, but high mana regen and higher spell damage. Your spell damage is not great. Your spell damage, however, is... Well, for now, I'm going to have you as more of a buffer anyway. Well, Kunai is not as good as Assessus. Alright. Yeah, so now every time he does that, he restores health and mana. Finish him off. Big crit, 126 damage, nice. Oh, come on. Nice. Alright, so. Skill point. Boost acid rain, or man upkeep, or increase the mana rain of part by 10%. But, I kinda like this. Every attack triggers an additional hit equal to 30%. Or, I can increase the number of arcane bolts. 40% increase. Bubble burst, I can pass on that. Um. Water damage. Or I can go the poison rate with this guy. Whenever this monster spends a turn without attacking an enemy, apply a random debuff on a random enemy. Interesting. Healing skills also apply a shield equal to 20% the amount healed. Whoa. Um, let's see. Sure. Alright, unfortunately I have to end it there. Uh, I'll be back to this though. Quick half an hour video. Uh, this is really cool.